local news that matters. You're watching KLBK bright and early. Welcome back to you. Samantha Mendoza joins us now for another edition of what they have happening to offer the community some fantastic things. Uh, Samantha, thank you so much for being with us. Yeah, thanks so much for having me. Yes, ma'am. All right, so we want to talk about the weatherization program the SPCAA offers the community, and it is absolutely fantastic. Talk to me about what it is. Yeah, so weatherization, it's a nationwide, it's actually the largest uh, energy efficiency program nationwide, and we offer it under our agency, SPCA, like you mentioned. And really what we do is we're trying to help our community combat those high energy bills. I mean, if you know, those cold months are right around the corner, fall and winter. And so what we do is we conduct an energy audit in uh, individuals' homes, families' homes. We go in, we see where there are areas for improvement, uh, whether it be repairs to the heating and cooling system, whether it be insulation, uh, you know, stripping of the doors, weather stripping of the doors. So we really go in there, we do it, conduct an audit and make sure that, um, you know, everything is, is up, to, up to code and everything looks good and ready for winter, really. And so we want to make sure that, of course, our community members are comfortable in their homes during the winter and in the summer months, um, but also that they don't have to pay those really high, ridiculous bills if they don't need to. Yeah, because that kind of work um, is really expensive. So this Absolutely. is a way to help folks out. Um, you know, weatherize their home. Uh, we live in Texas and it can get real intense on both ends of the spectrum, both summer and winter. You mentioned yes. that's coming up. Absolutely. Uh, I mean, I, I think back to not that long ago, we had that cold snap and the majority of the state lost a lot of power mm -hmm. during the winter months. I mean, I know personally I was living in San Antonio at the time. I lost power for about three days wow. and, you know, thankfully my home was well insulated enough that, you know, we were okay. But there are sadly some homes out there that don't have proper insulation or um, the proper equipment or, or appliances to, you know, help them get through those cold months. And so what we're really trying to do, like you said, is make sure that all of our members, our community are comfortable Mm -hmm. um, and they're safe during the winter months and in the summer months because it can get very hot as well. Um, but also that you know they don't have to pay those pay those high energy bills either if they don't need to. Who is eligible to take part in this program? So we mainly um, try and specifically service low income families, mm -hmm. uh, persons who are elderly, persons with disabilities, um, families who have young children. Especially, of course, we want to make sure that our children in our community are are safe and comfortable during the winter months. Um, but if you are someone who is uh, you know you know that you have a high energy burden in your home, we also try and put you on a priority list as well. Um, so if you go to our website as PCA.org or you go to our Facebook page, you'll be able to find all of the information there in terms of income requirements and whatnot. But, you know, a quick uh, tip to understand or see if you qualify or, it or not is if you receive SSI, um, if you receive veterans benefits, for instance, you more than likely qualify for the weather weatherization program. All right, perfect. Samantha Mendoza, thank you so much for being with us today. Yeah, thank you so much. Yes, ma'am. All right, so we've got a quick break. We'll be right back for you.